Good morning, Royals. I hope you all are doing well, feeling well during this corona, corona, corona outbreak, or whatever you want to call it. I'm up early. Well, it's not really early. I'm uh, if I was doing my other job, which is teaching, I'd be up like 6 a.m. It's 9 a.m. and I'm like, oh, it's so early because we're on a corona. We're on a corona break. Anyway, let's see. I, I got a text this morning. I got to sign some uh, some contracts. Well, I got to sign a contract. I just want to show you this is what you should be waking up doing. You shouldn't be waking up worrying about sickness and disease and stress stressful things you should be waking up trying to get your money because you need money to survive so get your money get your money invest try to figure out how to get off that red wheel how to get off that hamster wheel you can't do it forever you you gotta figure something out you got to get your freedom. Let me see. I got all these tabs open. It's crazy. Let's see what they're talking about. General info. Vanderbilt mortgage. Hmm. Hmm, what about that? Okay, let's see. He said he sent me the uh, contract. Okay, here it is. Most people use DocuSign. I use HelloSign. I like HelloSign. Let me show you a HelloSign. Hello Sign go here then log in hello sign then sign in with google or dropbox how still available see i get these i got about um this that one house that i posted i got about 50 messages yesterday and it's a rental so i'm going to make everybody fill out well it actually is not a rental it's um on a finance deal so i'm going to make everybody fill out an application and um go from there with that this is hello sign who needs to sign just me, me and others, just others. So if it's me and others, I go here. And then I just pull my document, add file. See all these files I have? You see all those dates? But um, not dates, but uh, addresses. 5812 Eastland, 912 West Cambro, 5505 Fernanda. So yeah, if I had a document that needed to be signed, I will uh, pull it from here and and that's they would they would convert it from PDF to a signable document, and then I would scroll here say prepare doc for signing. Whoever needs to sign it, I have to put their name and email address on that page right before before I go here. And then I'll scroll down. Let's say I need to sign it here. I'll go to signature and sign. Oh, sorry. Go to signature. Then I'll click where I need to sign. And then there's my signature. If I don't like that, I can um, delete. Okay, 
Just wanted to show y'all that real quick. Let me cancel out of here. Okay. Get out of here. Go back to the email. DocuSign. New Western. What? These people. I thought I was signing with some bosses. I mean, the Western's okay. I ain't gonna hate, but it's too communication. Hmm. I already know what they're trying to do. Let's see. They say you need to sell to New Western and not buy from New Western. So yeah, this is the assignment. Some agreement that I have to go over. Let's see. <sighs> Keep some of this private. Assignment fee, March Okay, so now I see why he was being all funny. Go ahead and close this. Now I see why he wasn't being up front because I kept saying, who's the buyer? Who's the buyer? I don't know who the buyer is. You're not telling me up front who the buyer is. And he was like texting LLC or something. But it's really New Western. New Western, they you know, they get on my nerves. They are, they are dominating Texas wholesaling. They are. I'm not gonna lie. It's just that they get these houses and they tell everybody. You know, they don't be having no buyers. They say they're the buyer. They say they have a buyer. They say they are the buyer. They don't be having no buyers, but they have to get it on the contract and then they tell everybody they know then the house is like over over marketed and from what i'm hearing for what i'm hearing they do do pretty well with getting buyers i'm sure they do because like they do those massive emails. I get a lot of their emails. I'll show you right now. I get a lot of their emails. Let me see. I even have a folder for them. What's this? I have a folder for them. Let's see. Yeah, they, they be getting these houses. They, 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 they do too much. It's like every time you look up New Western. 
sending deals or I mean I guess they I mean I guess they doing what they supposed to do but it's like they don't be upfront with how they're getting the houses. Maybe like I have a buyer. No you don't. You don't have no buyer. Let me see. I had a folder, I guess I don't know where my folder is for New Western. I mean, I see this folder, but I had another folder. Is this? Hmm. I had a folder for New Western. Let's see. Type in New Western. New Western don't be having no buyers, I'm telling you. But they're good at marketing, so they will find you a buyer. They will from what I hear, they will find your buyer. It's just that they have to put it out there the same way you put it out there. But they want to get the uh, contract before they do, which is fine. It's just they need to be more upfront and say, hey, we're New Western and we can help you sell your house. Not be like, hey, I have a buyer for you and I'm from Texan Mutual LLC, you know, some some name that they use to, as a cover-up. They be working, though, but like this one, Erica Butters, I guess she's new to the team. Her and like five other people will send you the same house, the same, same house. Cash price 309, built in 1944. No, I'm good. Yeah, these houses need to come down. It's getting ridiculous. It's getting really ridiculous. Who is this? Carrasco. What are your requirements to apply? So she's talking about the, uh, rent house that I'm trying to rent out well it's not a rent it's a owner fin it's an owner finance deal it's an owner finance deal let me show you my owner finance deal let me see how do I get to my page that's not my page I mean that's my group but my page is right over. <laughs> Come on. I don't want to go through a lot to get to my page. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Okay, there's the page. I just went ahead and made the page because um, Facebook kept on telling me. This is your page. Add to your page. Do something to your page. Facebook is so like intrusive. They just they kept on bugging me about making a page, so I went ahead and made my page. But anyway, this is the property that I'm renting out. Seven thousand dollars down. Uh, it's an owner finance deal. The house will be in your name once you sign the documents and pass the uh, application on to me first come first serve it's three bed two bed it's a mobile home in a hot area the area is grand prairie texas hit me up if you're interested 682-251-0981 so yeah, you'll pay seven thousand down. This will be your home. Your name will be on the license. You don't get deeds from mobile home; you get licenses. Your name will be on it, and you pay seven thousand down, eight hundred dollars a month. It's a three bed, two bath, and I will have inside pics probably tomorrow, not today. <laughs> uh, I didn't get any inside pics yet. I hope you'll have some. 
Anyway, so if y'all have any questions or need anything, just uh, let me know. A lot of these auction sites are shut. They're shut down, so you can't be trying to wholesale on the auction anymore like you want to. You have to just see what you can find on the other sites. What is this? Next. This is selfdfwhomesearch.com. What's my price range? It's no price range. Cheap. <laughs> Here you go. How about that? 50. No, not 50. Ooh, too much. 50 to 85,000. One bedroom. Next. One bathroom. They probably gonna show me some condos or something. How big do you want your house? Real small. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to register. I get tired of that. I always having to register. What's this? They want you to put your information out. Is this house still available? Yes, it is. I guess they're just not going to think about my search. Two thousand square foot, two thousand square feet for a million dollars? Hmm. What is this? In Burleson? With all those trees. Hmm. Let me see what they have up there at the top. One seventy five to twenty. I said don't go over fifty thousand. What are they showing me? They didn't show me nothing in my search criteria. Uh, I got my Google phone. People will hunt you down. The thing is, stop. Stop. Please stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the birthday call, birthday sack, birthday to the little ones, Jackson and London. They turn three and four. Let's check out the park. Come on. Mm -hmm. This is DJ Envy. Wow. And that's a birthday party. DJ Envy is a huge real estate investor. He has made millions off of his investments. He bought one house for 600000 that was in pre-foreclosure. And he sold it for over $1.5 or something like that. Um, and he, he just, he's a boss when it comes to New Jersey real estate. 
and of course he's a DJ as well so he, he just has all types of different uh, revenue streams <laughs> This is taking place at his house. So let's see, this is in 2017. I think he sold it by now. 2.3 million. Yeah, he probably sold it by now. 2.3 million dollar mansion. It's crazy. And this is DJ Envy's house. And Kenalon. Kenalon, he said, he said Kenalon, he chose it because it was a great uh, school district. Look at those shoes. Wow. See, shoes like that, I mean, I just I can't wear those shoes. I mean, they look good on the shelf. But I can't wear those shoes. The kitchen, yeah. It was alright. It could be better. <laughs> And that's nice. It's a nice sitting room. A bar. Wow. Nice hardwood floors. Nice chandelier. Six bedrooms on nearly seven acres. Hmm. If you want to sell million dollar houses, you have to find million dollar buyers. So let's say he sold this house. I will look up in the tax records to see who bought it. Let's say Kenalon, Kenalon. If I'm just going to be curious. Oh, Kenalon. Okay. So Kenalon, what? County is Kenalon City in. This is just that's just something I'm trying. Kenalon, boom, Wikipedia Wikipedia always got your back. It's not always completely accurate, but they will have your back. Kenilon is a bureau in Morris County, Georgia. All right, so it's in Morris County, Georgia. Okay, I'm not I'm on to my Georgia. Georgia's on my mind. Morris County, New Jersey. Morris County, County. So I'm gonna type in. Morris County property record search or property record search. Okay. Just for the heck of it. Let me see. I don't, I don't, I'm going to lose it. Okay. Let me go down here. Did they give the address? No, they didn't give the address. Okay, Kenalon. Wait a minute, hold on. Uh, let's do this. It says Trulia, so maybe I can find the address through Trulia. Oh, let's see. Oh, man, let me... 
Well, I'm not going to look for the house because I have other stuff I need to do. Truly, yeah. Oh my gosh, everybody's hitting me up over that. Mental. Can't align New Jersey. So let's say I, uh, let's see, price. Let's go to the max. Well, first, I'm, I'm going to just, just so I can see something. Hold on. I'm going to see what, if they have any cheap houses out here. Let me go to 100. Nope. Let me go to 200. Oh, uh, they got a few. Oh, that's most land. Get along land. For sale by owner. I swear I'm going to turn off the notifications for that house. <laughs> okay, so for sale by owner. Wow. Just a little bitty cottage, isn't it? But anyway, let me go here and let me just find any million dollar house. Go here. Oh, I didn't mean to put 200. I want to put, let me put 7 to 20 million. Okay, now we're going to get to the big, big bucks. That one's 920. It's brand new on the market. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like DJ Envy's house was like the most expensive house in the neighborhood. Let's see. This is 1.2. Wow. That's nice. Anyway, so this is the address right here. Sure. 817 West Shore Drive, Kinalon. Copy. Go here. Let's see. I'm going to go to Morris County. Make sure I go to the right website. Morris County, Morris County. It'll say ads related to Morris County. Let me see. It might, I think it's the first one this time. Property search records. Hope they're not like Detroit and make you pay $24 for one hour of search. Let's see. Let me type in a short camera. Get a fish. No, that's not. That's not the right website. Nope. I need to go to Morris County. Where is Morris County? Here it is, right here. See, mcweb. Dot, mcweb1. Dot co. Dot Morris. Dot nj. Dot u. Okay, so we go here. Paste. Go here. 817. Say district. Boomtown? I don't know. I know I'll put the wrong thing. Boomtown. Let's go here. See if I can get back to the original page. Uh, let's see. Let's see what district is it in. Let's see. The assessment one point six. I don't know what district is in.
Boom tail. Boom boom. Kill a lot. I guess it's a lot of killing on this tree. Property district. Is it in Morris Township? House number. I think i the West part and see if I can go. Probably tax year. Oh, let me do 2019. Let me just see if I can get anything. Okay, search about owner. Boom town. Owner. I'm gonna type in uh, a bus of arms. Let me see how I know. Let's see. I don't know. I don't know if you type in arms like jobs. So y'all don't have no jobs in Boom town. So in 2019, um, I'm from my house to the uh, searchers on their um, website. I don't do search because if I'm not, I'm not. information. I have to find that information. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, I know if I go to the Zillow, they'll tell me what county. They'll tell me, not what county. They'll tell me more information about it. So, Zillow, search for the world. And if you own Zillow. <laughs> they cut the price of $100. They're like, please, please buy this house, house, please. house please. One point. It's a beautiful property, but I think a lot of people not buying it anymore. They want a tiny house. They don't want to spend all their money on one thing, you know? But it's huge houses and then it'd be house poor. Let's see, that's the parcel, parcel number. Let's see. If they tell me what. Maybe go to San. It says. Killer. It says I have a uncle for Killer. What's it say? Okay, there's a parcel number, but I don't think I can search for a parcel number on their website. Oh, maybe they may have it. Option to search by parts for number. Let me see. Let's see. Yeah, I heard it right here. Let me see. Let's 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 see. Oh, man, come on. 
Okay, it was in the shore. Details. Boom. There you go. The owner's name, Pearson Theodore Maria. There's still those are the owners. Theodore and Maria Pearson. The land value is 389, improvement value 8.2, next, net taxable value 8.6. Mm -hmm. They pay 40, 41,000 a year for taxes. It's terrible. Okay. But if you got it, spend it. Right? <laughs> no, if you got it, invest it. Just spend a little bit. Okay, so it's Theodore and Maria Pearson. Let's see, who are they? Theodore Pearson. I wonder if he's a rapper or something. Theodore Pearson, New Jersey. Whoa! This is a dream. This is Theodore Pearson. Oh, <laughs> okay, yeah, true, true. That's a reading period. So I was going to say, is that there? 